Have you ever tried using AI to write a SQL query? It turns out large language models are great at generating text, but they're not so great at running SQL in a production environment. LLMs are trained on unstructured text and lack exposure to relational data and explicit table definitions, a problem known as training data mismatch. And that's where knowledge graphs come in. Knowledge graphs have been around for years, but only recently gained in popularity with the rise of large language models. But what exactly are knowledge graphs and how do they work? First, let's see how they differ from traditional databases. With SQL, data is stored in tables using rows and columns. They're great for storing structured data with a predefined schema. Document databases like MongoDB are great for storing unstructured data like text documents. However, they lack the ability to create and store relationships that can be searched upon. However, knowledge graphs combine the best of both, allowing you to store structured or unstructured data and information about their relationships. It works by storing the data as nodes and edges. The nodes represent objects like a user, a support ticket, maybe a document from your support docs, or a video. And then the edges represent the relationships between those nodes. So imagine here we have a user who submitted a support ticket, which is about a certain feature. And that feature might have a video in your documentation. So in this case, the relationships would define how these objects are related where this user submitted this ticket, which is about a feature and then this video is also about that feature. Now imagine trying to write a SQL query to get all the videos about all the features mentioned in all the tickets for this user. Good luck doing that in SQL. That's the true power of knowledge graphs. They allow you to search on the entities and their relationships with the relationships being directional. Sometimes they're only a single direction, and other times it can go both ways, like this user knows this user. This also enables new types of reporting that would be impossible in SQL, allowing you to uncover new insights about your data. Check out the link in the description to see how you can start building your own knowledge graph today.